it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I am here to do your daily reading for, what is it, 24? Yeah, Friday the 24th, but you know, the timing is fluid, so we'll see whatever comes up. We're going to get a couple of these, and we're going to get some of those, and we're going to go from there. Finances and career, financial issues are a factor in your love life right now. Maybe, maybe you're focusing too much on your job. Maybe you're not putting enough effort into love. Or maybe you just don't, you don't feel good because your, your finances and your career aren't where they need to be. Separation. Time apart from your partner is on the horizon. Hmm. Not a good start. At all. Maybe there has been a separation. Or there's going to be. Somebody is holding on to something. Resisting a change. King of Wands reverse. Somebody has lost their focus and concentration. Lost their energy, no ambition, no drive. Their job could be bringing them down. You know how that goes. When when one thing falls apart, it's like everything else shit goes downhill. Yeah. No ambition, no drive, no strength, no willpower. Somebody is losing confidence in something. I'm losing confidence. Mm. Somebody is making a decision as we speak. You know, you could be, this could have to do with work even. You know, this could be somebody deciding to separate from a job. I mean, I'm just saying it could be to separate from something that isn't fulfilling them. Maybe the job is taking a toll on your relationship. It's taking a toll on you, whatever it is. Giving up. Yeah, somebody is giving up on something. That's for sure. Not going to put any more energy into this. That's what it looks like to me. Whether it's a relationship or a job, somebody is like, you know what, I've, I've fought long enough. I'm, I don't have any more desire to give this another ounce, another ounce of my energy or anything like that. I think I've held on to it long enough. There's no more growth. There's no more growth here. Whatever it is, it's like I know there isn't. So somebody is, is moving on out. I'm moving out. I'm moving out of here. Get the hell out of my way. Mm. So it looks like there's no chance for reconciliation. You know, there's no chance for this to get better. Somebody has been involved in a situation where there was dishonesty. There's a lack of communication, a lack of, of compromise, a lack of uh, confidence. 
confidence that this could even work. It's like, you know what? There's no confidence in this. There's no growth in this. There's no future here. Whatever it is, whether it's a relationship or a job. It's like, I, I, can't, I can't be involved in this. This is really not making me happy. It may be even pissing you off. It's like, you know, I'm, I'm at the point where if you don't get out of my way, I need to get the hell out of here before somebody gets hurt. You know, that kind of energy. Um, yeah, somebody is involved in a, separ in a separation. In <laughs> a separation, in a situation where they want to separate from it and go find something more emotionally fulfilling. This is the last card. This is what happens when you remove yourself from this situation. That has no growth, okay? Somebody is involved in a situation that there's, there's dishonesty, there's lack of clarity, there's lack of truth, and it's stealing your power, okay? It's stealing your power. It's stealing your energy. And it's like you're ready to, you're ready to blow. You know, you're ready to blow. It's like you're ready to swiftly get the hell out. So I feel like today is a day of making this, the Seven of Cups reverse, is making that decision. The decision has been made. I'm not going to fight for this. I'm not going to give it my energy. I'm going to find something that I love. I mean, both of these cards are lack of awareness. So I think that somebody has been through a period where they dealt with it. You know, even though they were aware, you know, they, 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 you know, what's that word? Um, oh, jeez, I'm crow, my mind is blank. It's compromised, you know, ignored the fact that this wasn't working out. It's been ignored, Okay. So I feel like somebody decides to hastily accept the truth and hastily get out of this situation. I feel as though they may, they may have been obsessed with something for a moment, you know, obsessed with this tangible option, whatever it was, you know, it was something to have. But now it's got to the point where it's boiling over and it's about ready, somebody's about ready to blow. I'm about ready to freak. You know, that's what it looks like to me. I'm ready to get the hell out of this situation quickly. Because there's 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 no growth here. You could be involved with a situation that is smothering you. It's smothering you. It's just like this isn't this isn't emotionally fulfilling and I need to go find something that is. So I feel like this could have to do with your job. It could have to do with love. It could have to do with both. I don't know however it resonates with you, but there's an opportunity for something better once you give up on something that doesn't serve you. You know, once you stop giving it your energy, once you stop giving it your power, you take your power back, you make that decision to not put any more effort into it. Once you make that decision, you receive, you go after something better. So there's an opportunity for something new and more fulfilling at the end of all this. Bullshit. Okay, whatever this is, there's a, there's a lack of, of growth, a lack of confidence, a lack of ambition and drive and energy and clarity and it's just a big mess somebody is involved in a huge mess and they've really fought hard to make it work but now I'm giving up Somebody may just speak up, you know, there's been, there's been a lack of communication and this could be with bosses, this could be with friends, it could be with your partner. Somebody's been holding back their tongue and the, I think that holding back of the tongue is about to end, okay? I think that somebody is about to speak up and it could be a little harsh, all right? Um... Could be dealing with a Leo. 
a Leo, Aries, Sagittarius. We have Leo here, and then we have Leo again. So we have Leo twice, uh, and then we have Aries, Sagittarius. We have Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. We have Scorpio. We have Taurus and Libra. Could be anybody, but I do feel as though somebody has been holding back, and I think that those days of of holding back are done. Somebody's at the end of the rope. <laughs> and that's what I see. Yeah, I'm giving up. I'm giving up. You know, this is too stressful. Both of these nines are a time to move on. Two nines right here. I'm. It's time. It's time for me. And these are both reversed. Upright, you know, this is where it's happening. Reversed, it's letting go. Goodbye. See you later. Not going to hang on to this. this. It's too depressing for me. I'm letting it go. This is too stressful. Not interested. Yeah, somebody was dealing with a very tricky situation. Deception. You were dealing with a very crafty individual who had you manipulated. Totally had some tricks up their sleeve and they manipulated into believing something that was totally untrue. And I think you've made the decision to love yourself and, and relieve that and release that stressful situation. There's there's no chance here. Oh. So, you know, there's a you're dealing with somebody who is cold hearted, they don't communicate, where they're withdrawn. You're dealing with a know it all. Whether it's a boss or a partner. And I think that whatever this is, whoever this is for, you've stubbornly held on for some unknown reason. Stubbornly held on to somebody that was ruthless. A know-it-all. No compromise with this person. And you've done all the compromising. And now you're cutting something out. It's about time for me to do what's right for me. This may be a very intense time where you assert yourself and you assert your beliefs, you assert your needs. And I think that what's happening here is you are cutting something out of your life that you know has no growth. It's not a good opportunity. There's no growth in this opportunity, so it's being cut out. Quickly. Yeah, there's a release. Somebody is, is releasing something that was too stressful and they put a lot of effort into it but when you're dealing with these people that are so manipulative it's hard to free yourself I mean you are definitely dealing with a master manipulator here <laughs> okay master oh my god you are absolutely dealing with a master manipulator I mean this is the master of manipulators along with this one happens all the time. I say the word and the card comes out. This is somebody who is a know-it-all, a narcissist. We've talked about this before. There's a narcissist in the mix. No matter what you do, you can't please this person. Could be a boss. Could be a father. Could be a husband. Could be a boyfriend. Could be a wife. Okay? Whoever this person is, it's smothering you and is stealing your energy. 
and it's probably costing you money because it's costing you your concentration. It's costing you your focus. It's, it's stealing your ambition to even continue on this path. It's like I don't even have any desire to, to take another step in this direction. But, I'm, you know, maybe it's something that provides for you financially or in some way. There's a reason why you've been hanging on to it. But <laughs> it's about to blow up. So there's going to be a blow up. That And I was going to put this up here. Right over the... That forces somebody to move on towards something better. These nines are moving on. Releasing. So there's going to be a blessing in disguise. This this blow up is, is going to be a rude awakening that allows somebody to head towards something more emotionally fulfilling. So be prepared. The blow up could cause a separation. Okay? This blow up, this tower, could cause a separation from a job or a partnership. Because you deserve something more emotionally fulfilling. So whether this is today, tomorrow, next week, whatever, yesterday. This reading will not resonate with every single person, but it will resonate with many. Somebody is about to take back their power from somebody who has been controlling them for too long. Good luck. 